What's up everybody? It's your friend and real estate broker, David Rosen. So just sharing another story with you about real estate in New York City from the Brooklyn Bridge on my walk to work and uh, again, getting a lot of great feedback. So if you like uh, these Brooklyn Bridge walks, feel free to send me a note or, you know, like the video. Um, this weekend, my wife and child and I went and saw a home uh, right next to the home we just bought. So here's the situation. We bought a uh, beautiful two bedroom apartment and you can add a washer dryer and do central air, which is rare in a pre-war co-op that we own. It's got a windowed kitchen, it's great. We love it and we can't wait to move in. But our kid who's baby, um, you know, we was afraid one day he'll outgrow it. And then boom, the neighbor's apartment came on the market. And just like I've talked about, it came on for more money than we paid for it. And so I looked into it, could I buy it? Very complicated, because I already own the place next door. But my brilliant, uh, one of the brilliant loan officers I work with said I could buy it as a primary residence to say that the one I'd already bought was an investment, which is kind of true until we combined them. So, you know, we looked at what the payment would be. Our payment would have more than doubled. Now we're talking about going to like 12 to 13 grand a month territory. It's a lot of money. You know, three years ago, my rent was 2,700. Now my mortgage is $5,000 a month. But of that $5,000, you know, a lot of that's going to myself. I pay, I pay myself, so I don't mind. Um, and there's three of us now. Before there was just one of me. So you know, I feel great about that. But going to 13 grand a month, okay, that's a lot of money. But now, could I afford it? You know, if everything goes well, I could have afforded it. But if anything doesn't go well, then who knows? But let's get back to that. So basically, the combination would be insane. You go through the living room, which is really convenient, and you just have the biggest living room ever. 40 feet by 40 feet. Oh, I'm sorry, um, 20 feet by 20 feet living room. And then the home would be tremendous, like 2,200 square feet, let's say. Um, and we really just hemmed and hawed about it all weekend. We don't need it. It's too much for us. So sometimes you get into situations where your heart is a flutter, and it's just too good to be true, and it's okay to walk away. And when I said no, boy, were we relaxed. Have a great week, everybody. Talk to you soon. Bye.